Kim Kardashian went to see Ivanka Trump and Jared Kushner at their home after her Oval Office meeting with the president The reality star, who lobbied President Trump to pardon a first-time drug offender, was pictured last night arriving at the first daughter's home in Washington, D. C. Kardashian had spoken to Kushner at the White House earlier in the day as part of her efforts to have great-grandmother Alice Marie Johnson freed from prison Exclusive photos taken by DailyMail.com showed Ivanka smiling with Kim and her husband before Kardashian left the Kushner home at around 8 p.m. on Wednesday Kardashian, who visited the couple in Kalorama Heights, is thought to have been involved in private discussions with Kushner and Ivanka Trump for several months The celebrity has been urging the president to pardon Johnson, 63, who has spent more than two decades behind bars and is not eligible for parole Kardashian tweeted, I would like to thank President Trump for his time this afternoon It is our hope that the president will grant clemency to MS. Alice Marie Johnson who is serving a life sentence for a first-time, non-violent drug offense We are optimistic about MS. Johnson's future and hopeful that she, and so many like her, will get a second chance at life Earlier she had wished Johnson a happy birthday and said, today is for you. President Trump posted a picture of the meeting, saying, great meeting with that Kim Kardashian today, talked about prison reform and sentencing Johnson was imprisoned for life in 1996 for drug dealing and money laundering. It was her first offense She was found guilty after her 15 accomplices all testified against her and had their charges dropped, despite Johnson's minimal role in the cocaine ring Kardashian had a confirmed meeting on prison reform with Jared Kushner, who is a senior White House advisor Lawyer Brittany Barnett said it was her hope that Kardashian would also have an opportunity to plead Johnson's case to the president Trump last week granted a rare posthumous pardon to boxing's first black heavyweight champion, clearing Jack Johnson's name more than 100 years after what many saw as a racially charged conviction The boxer's pardon had been championed by actor Sylvester Stallone, who Trump said had brought the story to his attention in a phone call Kushner has led White House efforts at prison reform, drawing on the experience of his father's sentence in 2005 for tax evasion, illegal campaign contributions, and witness tampering The First Step Act would offer job training and drug treatment programs, as well as time off their sentences, as an incentive for inmates with good behavior The bill, passed by the House and currently before the Senate, would allow nonviolent offenders to spend the end of their sentences in halfway homes Kushner said earlier this month, the single biggest thing we want to do is really define what the purpose of a prison is Is the purpose to punish, is the purpose to warehouse, or is the purpose to rehabilitate?